You requested my presence, Master. Yes. Yes. All right, I'm going to lay out all of this nice and simple. Plan A. Turn Luke Skywalker to the dark side and all three of us kill Vader. Plan B. Luke Skywalker doesn't turn to the dark side. Kill him and then we kill Vader without him. Notice how in either scenario, Vader dies and you replace him. Sounds good, doesn't it? Sounds exceptionally good. Now go track down Skywalker. It's not like he's anywhere near here. As you wish, Master. <laughs> Minions. Very useful. Rule of two my puny ass. Having more than one person to do your bidding is great. Acolytes of the dark side enforcing my will across the galaxy. An entire galactic empire. A fully armed and operational battle station the size of a planet. My life has finally reached its peak. Nothing can stop me now! I have had it with you, Emperor. You're going down the chasm. Wait, 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 wait. What if we could rule together? Just uh, die already! Uh, I hate that boy! If only there was someone who could teach him a lesson! Modern day! Mara! Master? No time for chit chat, I'm falling down a chasm to my death! What? Avenge me! Kill Luke Skywalker no matter the cost! Master Skywalker. I want to know where he is. Please! I don't even know him that well! But you do know him. Where is he now? I don't know! Uh, Boba Fett! Yeah, Boba Fett! He can tell you! Where's he? Uh, 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 a few blocks down, his mailbox has this got his name on it. Mama, what's up? Yes, Billy. Now, uh, go to bed. Why do you always wear a tic tac toe, Zab? Oh, but it's just a game. It's really not worth crying about. Sister, you better. Where is he? Who? Look, I don't know who you are, but where is he? Uh, please don't kill me. I'll do anything. Then tell me where to find Luke Skywalker. Uh, 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 uh. That guy in the street knows. doesn't, then I'll be back to kill you. Bobby we'll getting speeder. And now, a ruffian come to mug me. What the hell? someone's face off. Where is Luke Skywalker? Who do you think you are? I ought to rip your face off for what you did to my speeder. I can do much worse than that. Now tell me, where is Skywalker? Skywalker, Skywalker, Skywalker. Oh, little Luke Skywalker. I haven't seen her in ages. 
Where did you last see him? It was at an after party for a pod race in this very town. We were eating pizza together and- And where is he now? Well, I do have a clue about that. He was talking to me about how he spent a lot of time on Naboo, and his house hasn't been occupied in years. So I can only imagine that he's there. Oh, was that it? Did I get like a, an evil thank you or something? No? <laughs> Wait, you're not going to kill him or anything, are you? I need a location, not something imprecise or approximate. Something exact. He's a pretty damn poor artist. I've been looking for this man for seven years. You'd better not be wasting my time or else I'll- I don't need the details, lady. I promise you, I'm telling the truth. He lives in the Big Gaudy Palace in the center of the city. The bloody prince. Oh! You could have told me that, master. What's he like? Actually, he's a very powerful Jedi Master these days. Not to be messed with. Plus he has guards around almost 24-7, but he can defend himself with them. He's a kick-ass killer machine. He'd whoop anybody before he even saw him. Is that a challenge, Trout Face? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'm just telling you the truth so I don't get killed. I'm going to need a plan. And I'm gonna need an ice pack. Phase one. Get a job at the palace as a guard. Phase two, creep up on Skywalker as he sleeps and kill him. Phase three, escape to the outer rim. Excellent. Skywalker will be dead. What are you doing? Ah! Uh, oh, okay, you didn't kill him. That's great because, but da da da, I have a brilliant plan, as always. You see, instead of getting revenge on my behalf, you're going to. Are you alive? I'm not alive, I'm a Sith ghost, you stupid girl. It just took me a while to figure out how to appear to you. It's been seven years since you died, Master. Really? I felt more like two. Eh, no matter. Now, back to my incredible plan I formulated in the afterlife. Why kill Skywalker when he is set to inherit an empire consisting currently of Naboo? And Corellia. Why, surely I and we would want this power for ourselves. Surely we would want this power for ourselves. But surely we would have no way of getting access to such power without killing him. Ah, ah, ah. No. Kings need queens, and Skywalker has no princess at his side, does he? And how should we find someone malleable enough to trust in such a position? How would we get said person into the position to- No, no, Barra. Everything we need, we already have. Well, you have, anyway. I really don't understand. Uh, I really should have trained you in things outside of killing people, perhaps given you a simple concept of- Ah. Uh... You know, I'm going to lay this out really nice and simple for you. Step one, marry Skywalker. Step two, kill Skywalker's mother and make it look like his father did it. Step three, use your new power to conquer the galaxy on my behalf. Step four, produce a loyal heir to the Imperial throne who will continue to do my bidding after you have lived out your life. Sounds exceptionally brilliant, doesn't it? I fear that death has not served your sanity well. Do you remember that Skywalker killed you? I remember all too well, child. The years of being dead have given me time to mother over there. Revenge is, after all, only second to power. But... Outstanding. Now go marry him, kill his mother, have children, conquer the galaxy, all that good stuff. I'll check in with you in a week, uh, Tarmala. Master, wait! Surely there's another- 
I'll haunt you for the rest of your life if you don't. BTW. <sighs> what the bloody crip just happened? Okay, what is it this time, old man? I felt a disturbance in the force, Hank. Not this again. You're not a Jedi anymore, Pops. The dark side is close by. It's getting stronger, son. I told you once, I told you a million times. It's just old man Dooku over there, okay, Gramps? It's different this time. I fear something terrible is going to happen. You must inform a Jedi of this. Listen! Do it now! This is more important than you know. Fine, I'll go tell a crimpy Jedi! Leia, do you feel it? It's in the air? You go tell Mom and Dad, I'll fight Han and Ben. But shouldn't I fight? Just go! It's here, Mom. It's come early. I've sensed it myself. We need to get off planet right now! I'll alert the staff! Sure is some wind out there, right, kid? So, uh, the old man wanted me to tell you. Han, we need to get off planet. Okay. I'll bite. Why? She's coming. Who's coming? Your grandma? Don't you know? Can't you feel it? It's the Croc Nido! What the crip is that? The Croc Nado! We gotta find Ben! A Croc Nado? Oh my force, Han! It rotates around the planet and comes here every 10 years! And it's come early! Find Ben! Can do! Marry a man I've never met? Bad chance! Master has clearly lost his mind in the afterlife. Today, Skywalker dies. Hey, watch it! Are you Luke Skywalker? Thankfully, no! Where is he? I haven't got time for another one, you fangirls! You should be running for your life! The Croc NATO is coming! The Croc Bloody NATO. Oh, damn spice. Heads. Wait! Is everyone here? Yes, just get on the ship! Huh? <gasps> the Royal Shuttle. No! Grandpa, what was that? It was the Crocnado, Ben. It comes every. I want to hear it from Grandpa. Okay. It was the Crocnado. It comes around every ten years to the palace and destroys it. What? So, every 10 years, we rebuild the palace on top of the rubble once the storm has passed. That's how the city of Theed has become the highest populated point on Naboo's surface over time. How did the Crocodile get there? It spins around Naboo's axis. I don't understand, Grandpa! Uh, it spins around in a circle around the planet. Then why don't you rebuild Theed someplace else? Because between all the gator natos and the gunkin reserves, there's really nowhere else. Uh, uh, I told you Nabo's stupid. Not that it matters now, because we're going to Coruscant. Where am I? Quite unusually for someone who isn't a Croc-Nato. Still alive. That doesn't answer my question. Wasn't supposed to. Who are you? Not unimportant. Do you know the location of Luke Skywalker? When did this become an interrogation, Missy? Tell me! Why do you want to know so bad? You do know where he is. Maybe. Tell me now! You need this information really bad, don't you? Tell me, and I'll spare you. Pay me, and I'll spare you. You're a bounty hunter? No, I'm a moisture farmer. What's your price for kidnapping a prince? Oh boy, curse on fumes, gotta love them. Oh my force, I am finally where I belong. I'm pretty sure some gang hates me around these parts. 
You mean yo candy club money? Oh yeah, it was candy club. I think I owe him spice. What, was it money? I can't remember. Maybe it was like dangerous animals. Let's just hope the Crocnado passes soon. I can't stay to talk about it. Never mind see it. See what exactly? Force damn it, Luke, it's right there. I'm talking about the temple. Oh. 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 Jedi Temple! Yeah. That. I gotta see it! Why is Uncle Luke so weird? He just is, Ben. He just is. No chance, lady. I travel solo. Will you listen here? I have been looking for this man for seven years. And I'll bring him to you in seven days. Sound good? All right. Fine. Just bring him alive. Of course. You just have my money ready. Don't even think about following me. Your ship's as good as dust. Cock. Hey, Leia, you gotta see that. You're not Leia. No, I'm not, am I? Where's my lightsaber? You mean this lightsaber? Leia! You mean this lighter? You're coming with me, pretty boy. Don't worry, princess. He's still alive. For now. Leia! Leia! Oh, I better call out Luke's name too. Luke! Leia! Where are you? <coughs> Leia? Oh, what the hell? Dad, it's, it's Luke! He's being kidnapped! By who? I, I don't know, some Mandalorian. A Mandalorian? Well, he's dead. What? Dad, no! He didn't kill him when he had the chance, he... There was nothing you could have done, Leia. No! He's alive! I can sense it! We have to find Mom! Come on, come on. It's nearly a whole week now, Fett. What are you doing?! Mother, I specifically told you not to kill Skywalker! But I haven't! Yet? No. No! You will marry him just as I have- Oh! Here he is. Just on time. Is this him? You mean to tell me? You don't know what he looks like. I could have chosen any random bloke. Uh, well, I... I... That's him, Mara. Jago Fett, give my lightsaber back! So you can kill me. Nice try, kid. Now give me my money. Uh, don't bother, Mara. Just kill him. Don't you think they can hear you, Master? Who are you talking to? I'm only showing myself to you, you stupid girl. Who are you? Give me my money, or you die. No. All right then. Have it your way. You're a Jedi. Holy Lord. You can't win, Django. Not against two Jedi. Maybe not, but I'll be back. And you'll both be sorry then. Enjoy your last days, ladies. Okay, who are you and why did you have me kidnapped? Don't you dare kill him. I won't. You won't what? Say something! The... Uh, uh, I... Uh... Well, Mother, just say something! Anything! Just say something! Uh, Luke Skywalker, the Force has directed me to you. Honest too? So you are a Jedi? Um, yes. The Force has told me we have a lot to learn from being together, and that I should find you right away. Okay, but isn't having me kidnapped a little... Since it's been so long, I think we should make up for lost time. By doing what? 
by spending every spare minute together. All our time from now on shall be spent together. All of it? Are you a humble servant of the Force or not? Well, yeah, but... Then stay with me. Bala, this won't work! You're blowing it! As in, stay with you in the rubble of my home. Well, no, I wasn't really thinking that. I was thinking more of Coruscant. Live with you? Uh, Coruscant, you say? Yes, it's my home planet. Okay, yes, yes, you're totally right. I should listen to the Force, even though it never said anything to me about you, and live with you on Coruscant. Wonderful. You moron, can't you see? I am Jedi Knight Jade, and I look forward to getting to know you, Luke. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Master Jade. Let's find a ship. <laughs> My baby boy! <laughs> He's gone! He could still be okay. No way, if it was a man though, he's long gone. <laughs> the chances of him surviving a Mandalorian attack are 1,023 to 1. Would you all stop it? He's alive! I'm his twin sister, I would know. We need to find him. Okay, assuming he's the one in 1,023 who actually survived, the best place to start would just be finding out which bounty hunter took him. You better go to the cops. Let's go. Uh, no. I'd rather not have the cops see me. You go, sweetheart. I'll be here with Ben. You and your stupid criminal record. You know, Master Jade, it's not exactly the Jedi way to threaten to kill people so you can steal their ships. It was necessary. Okay. The sooner I get back to Coruscant, the better, I guess. He thinks you're crazy. I'm inclined to agree with him, Mala. Oh, don't worry, he'll grow to love me. Of course I understand. I am following orders. Oh my force. He's crazy. Of course I will! So, uh, who is your master? What? Oh, nothing, nothing. Uh, you just seem to talk to him a lot. That is classified information. Well, if we're gonna be living... Classified! Okay, classified! We're here. Where's here? Well, where do you think? Coruscant? Even as a 73-year-old Mandalorian bounty hunter who's had his head cut off and sewn back on. That sounds pretty terrifying. It was awful! I bet you're looking for compensation. I sure am! My insurance supplier never believed me! Well, I do. And I have a plan as how we're gonna make this woman pay. You do? Ah, oh, yes. And it's a real killer. The visor was a shape of a T, and it was mostly silver and blue. Uh -huh. He had a, a gravelly, aggressive voice with, like, a, a weird accent. Uh, honey, you're describing Django Fett. Are you sure? 99%. Sorry, but your boyfriend is most likely dead. Brother! He's my brother! We'll send a search party out for brother. He's my brother, but don't get your hopes up. <sighs> Master J, so, I got like, you know, family I was staying with on Coruscant before you had me kidnapped. What's your point? Well, I just kind of wanted to let them know what's up and, you know, what happened to me, that I'm alive and all that. You can't. I mean, it would be pretty bad if the cops came and found me. And thought you kidnapped me, which you totally did. Yes, you're right. Point taken. Let's go. All my force. You sure you don't want to wait outside? Yes, for the 47th time. I'm positive. Okay. Jerky's alive. Ah! Luke! You're okay! I was so worried! Okay. 
How are you? Why are you down with Leia? <coughs> Just don't get kidnapped again, okay, you loser? Then Luke! Yeah, that's me! Well, like a grandson survive! Who's she? What's she doing here? Aww. Oh. Yeah. About her, this is Jedi Knight Jade. I saved Skywalker from the notorious bounty hunter, Jango Fett. You saved my baby boy? Oh, welcome to our home! Well, vacation home. Mom, she's not. I'm Pepe. Come in, come in! Any savior of Luke's and a Jedi wanted that is welcome here! Mom, you're not getting it. Thank you. It's a pleasure meeting you, Pepe. Come on, everybody back inside! Her face ought to be ripped off for what she did to my speeder. I love it. Ripping faces off. Love it. Will you help me rip her face off? That's what I'm here for. And so that's when I finally realized the baby was in the cargo hold the whole time. How did I even survive that? Literally, no one knows. Maybe you're just special or something. <laughs> you definitely are special. Can we talk? Privately for a moment, Master Jade. Fine. And that's how he got his weird scars! Grandma! Okay, okay. Who are you and what the hell are you doing? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. A robot told me he was my brother. Try me. Alright. You know what? Griffith, this whole thing's in a disaster anyway. My name is Mara Jade. My master was, and now is again, Emperor Palpatine. His dying wish was for me to kill you, and I have spent the past seven years searching for you to fulfill that. I found Django Fett last week, thieved and paid him to find you. You know the rest. Your master was Palpatine? Yes, the one and only. Um, <laughs> why aren't I dead yet? Oh, because he changed his mind sometime last week. But he's dead. I mean, he is dead, right? Yes, he's dead! You made sure of that, didn't you? Oh, the hell? Two words. Sith. Ghost. Oh, my force. Oh, my force. Sith Ghost are real? Is, is he here right now? No, I'm not sure of where he currently is. So... What does he want you to do instead of kill me? Well, that's the funny part. What's funny about it? Uh, oh, let's just think. In his own words, revenge is only second to power. So he's decided that instead of killing you, that I should marry you. And that we should take over the galaxy together as King and Queen of Naboo once I kill your mother. Also, my dear, Master can rule through me as I manipulate you into doing his bidding. And then he'll do the same thing to our hypothetical descendants until the end of time. And if I don't do it, he'll haunt me for the rest of my days. I'm not gonna do that. Are you insane? Don't answer that. I'm not crazy. Oh, I think you are. You need to be arrested for planning to murder my mom and take over the galaxy. We can do this the easy way or the hard way. Well, it looks like you just chose the hard way. What true is that? That's how weird it was. My, it sounds like a lightsaber duel is taking place in the kitchen of this apartment. My auditory senses must need updating. No, you don't ask piece of tinfoil. We can all hear it too. Well, you are half joy. Go clean something, 3 po Stop bugging us. Okay, back to the lightsaber fight. Who's gonna find out what's going on? Well, someone needs to find out what's happening. Anakin, go see what Luke is doing. I am too old for this, Kark. What are you even doing? Why tell me your whole plan? I'm trying to do the best thing you want to do, but if you ask me on a longer term basis, I have absolutely no idea. But what are we fighting about? You want to arrest me, you simpleton? That's what you said you wanted to kill my mom. I never said I wanted to. This is all your fault. If you had just left the Emperor alone, we wouldn't be in this mess. Oh, I'm the bad guy? Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Next time, I should plan seven years in advance before I do anything. Well, I'll save the galaxy for tyranny. If anyone should be arrested, it should be you for murdering the Sovereign in cold blood. 
Let's go. It's a good thing I don't need a lightsaber to kill you. I can shoot you, beat you, or strangle you. Hello, ladies. Dad, give me my lightsaber. You mean this lightsaber? How do you get those? Where's my blaster? You mean this blaster? Where's my? I have all your weapons. Let's not waste time here. Fine. Here's the money. Oh no. I don't want that anymore. I know who you are. And you have much more than a few thousand credits to offer. I don't know what you're talking about. You've got an angry mob waiting for you around the corner. What do you want from me? The Emperor's money. I'm gonna give you two options. Option one is letting the mob beat you to a pulp and, if you live, going to prison for the rest of your life. Option two is me taking you to safety for giving me all your inheritance. I don't have any inheritance! Five. Four. I don't know what the hell you're talking about! Three. Two. Just tell me how to access it! Your money, princess, you tell me. One. Time's up. Listen, I don't know how to access the money. Fair enough. Now, gentlemen! Oh! What's happening? Your family's been stunned, kid. Should be awake in four or six hours. Maybe longer. Are you taking Uncle Luke with you? Yeah. Yes! Where am I? Where's my blaster? I hate you so much, you crazy brat. You wrecked my speeder! You threatened to kill me! You terrorized the whole town! Steve Batchel from PTSD! You killed my cat! She stole my tailbone! You burned my home down. You stepped on my cheeseburger. Well, it's true. So, what are you going to do about it? Well, at first, we were going to lock you up forever, only keeping you alive on fish heads and pig swill. But this chap Django told us to seek compensation instead. We all thought it seemed like a splendid idea, so now we're just keeping you here until you pay up. Sometimes feeding you fish heads and pig swill. Why can't I go? Because I'm not done with you yet, Blondie. Nobody threatens a fit. And lives to tell the tale, boy. <laughs> okay. No one threatens me and gets away with it. I'll be back later. Come on now, people. Give them time to think about our options. You have 24 hours, girl. I already tried that. The lock is force proof. All cages. Criff. Did I mention that I hate you? Ugh. Master, show yourself. No, no, I disown you. Just give me access to your bank account. Why should I? Oh my force, it's him. I'll do anything you ask of me. No more deviations from your plans. I promise. All right. Continue the plan I have. I can't! Yes, you can. Tell Skywalker to marry you. You'll both die at the hands of Fett if he doesn't. Why not cut out the middleman and tell me what to do? I'm right here. Because I only trust Marla, not the boy who murdered me. I won't do this. Then you will die. And I'll enjoy every moment of the agony that puts you through. Just do it, Skywalker! No! I won't let you terrorize the galaxy through me! Not terrorize. Do you actually want to die? No! I don't want to marry you either! Besides, Jago's gonna kill me either way! I don't even know why I'm alive right now! Death by your own lightsaber, how about it, kid? Okay, fine, I'll marry you, Mara. Just don't kill my mom. I'm gonna enjoy this. I'm glad you finally see reason. Fat! The only way I'm going to give you the money is if you let Luke live. Okay. And you're not to harm him in any way. You're not fun. Excellent. Here's the information. Pleasure doing business with you. What about our share? 
What about it? Get him! Okay. Well, a promise is a promise. You're my fiance now, I guess. I hope you're happy, because I'm not. Deal with it. Where are we? You know, it's ironic. The empire I fought so hard to defeat is coming back by manipulating me. I guess that's karma. Shut up! Do you know where we are? Toshi Station. Hey, I wonder if they still have my power converters. Toshi Station. A wonderful wedding venue. Listen, I like Toshi Station as much as the next guy, but it's nowhere to have a wedding emperor. I'm the Crown Prince of Naboo, and I have to get married like the Crown Prince. On Naboo. No. No! You will do exactly as I say, boy! No, you listen here. I'm gonna marry your precious apprentice because I'm a man of my word. But... I didn't agree to do anything else. You follow my plan or I haunt you. You'll be haunting me either way, Emperor. I don't think you know what I mean when I say haunt, boy. Skywalker, please. What? How bad is it? Sleepless nights. Crawling skin. Terror beyond your worst nightmares and so much more. Every sin shall bring another dimension of torturous suffering. You will see such horrors that you claw your own eyes out. And the only music to accompany these things shall be my endless laughter. So loud in your ears it sends you to insanity. Your mind will be shattered and no one will ever know why. <sighs> Okay. Right. What do I gotta do to avoid this again? Marry Mara like you said you would. How about we have a wedding five years from now? Get it done right now, or else. You know what? Who cares about where we get married as long as we get it done? Like, like you said, right now. See, he's getting it, Mara. The boy can be taught. Rather unfortunately. Watch your tongue. I am seeing Tashi Station in a new light. I mean, Tashi Station? This is where we're gonna start the rest of our lives, honey. If you call me that again, I'll break your arm. Yeah, I know. All we need is someone to marry us. I think I know just the guy. Hey, Bab, my poor cheeseburger. Huh? Hey, Fortuna, Bib Fortuna, my man! You gotta marry me and my hair right now! No way! She stepped on my cheeseburger! Listen, man. This is a matter of life and a fate worse than death for the both of us. I don't care about your three-year-old stepped-on sandwich in your hand. I don't care. A cheeseburger is a cheeseburger. I don't want to have to do this, but you leave me no choice. You will marry us. No. You will marry us cheeseburgers. I will marry you cheeseburgers. This is going so well. Oh, oh. Is everybody here? Well, Janko Fett is gone. Oh, but he was kind enough to leave my Vader saber. No crypts given, obviously. <coughs> oh, hate that carpet. Leia, why are we lying on the floor? Because you were stunned. Oh, it's you. Wait, my money. I gotta check on the money. Money's not a problem, doofus. You're a prince, remember? But, yeah. Ah, you're awake. Hi, Grandpa. <laughs> Ben, what happened to Uncle Luke? Django Fett took him and that angry lady. Seriously? He got kidnapped by the same guy two times in a row? What an idiot. He's supposed to be a Jedi now. But I guess that would explain why he sucks so bad. He stunned you too. What was that? 
Hey! Three P.O. Why didn't you tell us a bounty hunter was in the apartment? You told me to go clean things and not to bug you. So I only did as you said and let him in. I also passed down your commands to Artu. Oh my head. <gasps> Dad! Where's Han Luke? I'm right here. Why doesn't anyone worry about me? Han, what happened? Where's Luke? Uh. He was kidnapped by Django Fett again. Oh, and that girl was a crazy follower of Palpatine's trying to kill Luke for revenge. What? I stopped her. We have to go and find Luke. He's in trouble. No. Padme, no. He's a grown ass man. If he's dumb enough to get kidnapped by the same blue and silver action figure twice in a row, it's his stupid problem. He can deal with it. After all, he's a wise and powerful Jedi Knight now. Oh, and I suppose it was your stupid little problem when Obi-Wan cut your legs off. And the second time he did. Or the time that Sith Lord cut your arm off. Or the time you got kidnapped by pirates. It was also your stupid problem all the millions of times Soka got kidnapped. And I suppose it was your stupid fault for ever marrying me! I didn't ask for help. Do you hear Luke asking? You listen here, and you listen good. We're all gonna find Luke if it's the last thing we do. If you won't help me look for our only son, then mark my words, Anakin. We. Are. Through. Have you seen this kid? Have you seen this kid? He thinks he's a man, but he's actually a kid. Literally has a fluffy mop on his head. Ugh. Where the hell is he? Any objections to these two getting hitched? I object. Luke deserves better than her. We went over this, Walter. Fate worse than death. Whatever. Okay, smooch your lady so I can leave. We haven't brushed our teeth in days, so this could be a bit nasty. Walt, do you have any mints? Come on. <laughs> okay, cheeseburgers, you're married. Bye. You can stop that now. <coughs> I'll see you in another seven years, Luke. Maybe sooner? We'll see. Goodbye! <laughs> You're such a lucky, lucky girl! Being married to Luke! Just remember, if you really want to impress me tonight... Yeah, please leave. Bye-bye! My wife is liable to break off the limbs of people who annoy her. Ah! Look at you already speaking for me. Two minutes into being married, no less. How wonderful. Hey! I was just trying to stop you from hurting her or worse. Because I know how much you like doing that. You don't know anything about me. Where are you going? Off planet. Not without your husband, you're not. Skywalker, follow her. Excuse me, have you seen my son? Have you seen my son? Who? Luke, my son. He looks like this. See, isn't he handsome? Sure is. Hey, get lost, seafood! Ugh. Mom, this is hopeless. Well, it's not like the police are gonna do any better! Mistress Padme, may I be so bold as to point out a flaw in this search? Go on. It would be helpful to describe the girl, too. He was last seen with her, after all. And there was Django Fett as well. He's very easily identified. Oh, yeah. I guess so. What, have you fallen in love with her now, 3PO? You want to go and kill her family when she rejects you? Oh heavens no! What an odd suggestion! Yeah, very odd. Hey you, have you seen Django fed anywhere? Mara, what are you doing? Looking for a ship. To go where? Back to Coruscant. I'm struggling to find one with enough space for two people though. Two people? Well, I don't fancy sitting in your lap for two days straight. I don't understand. What's your plan? We're going to steal a ship and take it to Coruscant while we wait for Naboo to be rebuilt. I'm not stealing! Oh, I'm sorry, darling. Do you want to earn the money? Here? On Tatooine? We can live on the streets and eat sand every night. You know, 
Um, second thought, my family really do need to know I'm alive. People usually start getting worried on the second consecutive kidnapping. Exactly. Now I think I see a ship I like. So I'm basically out of a job now. Eh, same here. Ah, uh, guys look. <laughs> Criff, she looks mad. Give me the details, Zab. She's waving a lightsaber around. What? what? Give me a ship! No! No isn't an option. Hey, back off! Move! I'm not afraid to use these things. Ezra, a little help? <laughs> Come on, let's get on! Hey, what's going on? Who the hell are you? Why? Uh -huh. Is he dead? <laughs> no, he's alive. Best make sure. <laughs> How long until we get to Coruscant? Is this pathetic hyperdrive a week? So, I guess we're gonna be sitting around for a while. Maybe starving. How did you end up meeting the Emperor? Just out of curiosity. He raised me from infancy. Why? This was pre-Vader, so he wanted a personal assassin, I suppose. Wait, so you're literally just an assassin? There I was thinking I was special to you. Oh, please. I've been doing this since I was a little girl. What about you? Nothing that can compete with the magnitude of that. I'm just a kid from Tatooine whose mom happens to be a queen. <laughs> and a poet, apparently. How old are you? 24. Hang on. You've been searching for me for your entire adult life? Well, I hadn't thought of it that way, but yes. Wow. You know, you could have just looked at the holonews to find me. Um, I'm pretty famous. Well, of course I realize that now, don't I? Well, it's lucky you didn't. If you had found me any earlier, then I'd be dead. Whoa. I wouldn't have killed you. Why not? Because I... I... Listen, Skywalker, I... Yes? Can we put everything that's happened between us behind us? I never had any intention of following through with uh, everything, you know. Then why... Well, after I met you. Mara, I think... Why did we stop? You know, I bet you thought you were a real wise guy switching on the hyperdrive while I was fixing it! Uh, let's see... We could be going ten times as Criffin first if you let make Criffin finish! But no, you switched it on early, and now we're Criffin strength! I could also have gotten a better job washing Criffin dishes somewhere, you know why? You know Criffin why? Cause you don't Criffin pay me! You treat me like Criffin garbage, and you don't give me a Criffin credit for it! I feel very hurt right now, and frankly, I want an apology. Hi. That was... abrasive. Ten... times faster? Ah, great, more thieves! Who the Criff are you, slime suckers? You know, I'm not even gonna ask. Bon voyage, I'm jumping ship. You're absolutely not. You're going to fix that hyperdrive. Oh, even better. More Criffin sideshows. I don't need this. Do you know how to fix hyperdrives? No, I don't. You? Nuh uh. Later, slime suckers! <laughs> Wait, we're stranded. Now I don't know if you noticed that or not, but the smaller ship seemed to take off perfectly fine, didn't it? It did. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, Criff me. Oh, Criff me in my life, I gotta go back! What do we do now? I don't know. This was your idea. Hey, y'all, listen, you Criffin freaks. 
I want to make this short and sweet. I want my Play Droid magazine collection here. Can't live without it. Some of those are Criffin Vintage. You will repair this ship's hyperdrive. You're absolutely right. I'll go do that right now. Kiss my rocket booster, lady. Uh, okay, there's the one with the Hula Protocol droid. There's the one with... Woo! With the Chrome Dot 6 unit. And the... Battle Droid Weekly? How'd that get here? Eh. You will- Hold on. Let me handle this. What, you got some sick perversion? These are droids, you criffa! That they are. And if you don't fix that hyperdrive, I will lightsaber every single one of them in half. Criff you, man! Fine, I'll fix the hyperdrive. Just too bad no one can fix those ass cheeks you have for a chin. Ass chin. I'm impressed. Nicely done. Thanks. How long will it take to fix that robot? You tell me, ugly. Could be days. Just fix the hyperdrive! I don't know what just fix the hyperdrive means to you on Coruscant, sweetheart. But criff me! Well, you'll forgive me if I don't criff you. You know, I think you should have married the droid instead of me. You have way more in common. R2, no one here can understand you. Yeah, because I'm special. I'm the freaking chosen one, okay? Why does everyone forget that? I can fix anything, I can fly anything, I can make anything, and fight with anything, I can beat anyone, and I can understand every language. Wow, that's amazing. Could you fix my watch? Depends. Have you seen that kid? Well, I, I don't think so, but I... Then beat it. Are you sure you can't do this any faster? I'm going as fast as I can! Now do me a favor, Criff off! Okay! Okay! I'm cripping off now. Well, at least we were lucky enough to find such a polite droid. I heard that, you Criffa! Just fix that bloody hyperdrive! This ship is apparently where politeness flops onto its belly and painfully dies. He started the swearing. Is it too late for you to strangle me to death? Look, I've already told you I wasn't going to kill you. I ask you politely if we can forget about everything that's transpired. I think we're gonna have to. So, ah, uh, what now? Well, we have one option. We wait until the hyperdrive is repaired. Well, yeah, I know, but I mean, it's gonna take a while. And? Don't you want to do something? Talk about something? I don't really know. Um, well, what do you usually do with your friends? I've never really had any friends. Oh, well, you can have one now. I, I know we're already married, so I mean, it's kind of weird, I guess. And the, do you want to be friends, Mara? Yes, I do. Hank. Oh, Criff, you found us. What does Criff mean? Hank, I finally found you. How did you even get here? Well, I took the emergency space bus off Naboo. After all this time, I finally found you. Now, I need you to put me in a new nursing home with lots of food and comfy beds and pretty nurses. Oh, for forces Criffin's sake. Look, let me try and get this through your dumbass head. I'm... You still with me? Not... Paying for you... Anymore! But I can't do anything for myself. I'm 91 years old. I need care. You made it here all right with your pie and trash can hat. Go take the space bus the hell out of here. <laughs> you need to give me more respect. This isn't how you raised me. I know, Pops. Go away. Well, maybe I will. And I'll be laughing my head off when you come crawling back to me with a groveling apology. You'll come to your senses, Hank. You'll come back to me with a groveling apology. Yes, you will. 
I'll be right, and you'll be wrong. You still need me, Hank. You'll come to your Oh, it'll be a cold day in hell when that happens, Dad. Mara. Psst. Mara. What is it? I have a plan to get us away from that droid. Let's take the little ship. <laughs> You'd just love the coziness of that, wouldn't you? I can think of worse things. Like being on this busted ship with that droid. Let's do it. You first. What are you doing? Thinking about ejecting you. Mara! But I think that would be cutting my nose off to spite my face. <laughs> Goodbye! It's out of fuel, asshats! <laughs> then fill it up. Can't! We ain't got no more fuel and you have to be outside to fill the tank. Did I mention you need hands, too? It should be a breeze with our zero spacesuits. Just hold your breath and hope you don't get too cold. Oh, and hold on to the ship for dear life. We don't even have a bungee cord. You've made your point. Go and fix the hyperdrive. I came in here for parts, Ginger. Now move it so I can tear the console apart. Oh, and this will create a flurry of sparks that could cause third degree burns and blindness. So be on, let me work. Fine. Do you think the sparks could kill me? Nah, just mutilate you and make the rest of your life even more pathetic. Okay, I'm leaving too. Are you looking forward to all the days it's going to take to fix- There! She's fixed, you bitches! Just needs a couple hours to warm up and we'll be going full speed. Oh, excellent! You're dismissed. Dismissed? Nah, listen here, lady. I wanna know who the criff you two are, and why you're going to Coruscant. I'm Luke Skywalker, and- Better known as Ashton, I'm sure. And who's you? My name is Mara Jade. You may refer to me as Mistress Jade or Master. Our mission is classified. You. Are. Dismissed. No offense. No, wait, I do mean offense. But your lady friend is a biatch, Ashton. Mistress or Master? Nah, your name is Biatch from here on. What's your name? Well... It's a droid, Skywalker. Who cares? You know, Skywalker is your name now, too. Oh, and there I was, thinking it was Princess. Only on Naboo. I'm not changing my name. Well, since you asked and didn't forget about the question and start ignoring me straight after, they call me... Killer. What's your real name? They call me... Six Blades. Since I torture people with high-end shaving kits. It says Hera on its ass end. Hey, that is not my name! That's my old owner's name! Quit looking at my ass! I'm gonna call you that until you give your real name. They call me Chopper. Because I chop people into tiny pieces and- Chopper is a pun on your serial code, isn't it? Yes, yes it is. So, as you can probably guess, my job is fixing this heap of crap. What's the deal with you two? You married, dating, friends with benefits. One time you had married, we're married. You professional thieves then? In a way. I think I'm gonna like you two. You wanna know the best planets to loot? No, we're not thieves. Well, I'm not. We're both Jedi and royalty. <laughs> whoa, 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 you made me make robot noises. Did you say royalty? Ah! Uh, wow! I didn't even know Coruscant had royalty. We're not- Oh, well in that case I better actually set the coordinates for Coruscant. You mean to say they weren't already set for Coruscant? Well, I was gonna sell you to Zygarian slavers since they deal with Jedi slash lightsaber dudes real well, but not anymore! To Coruscant! We're going to cut him into shrapnel when we get there. Oh yeah. Here we are, Coruscant, home to every fancy ass in the galaxy. Land the ship. I can't yet. You gotta help me input the ground release code. You can only do it manually, and I ain't got no fingers. Okay, fine, whatever gets us down there. There, 
Ass chin, get into that little porta potty shaped closet with your girlfriend. You press and hold the button, she can lift the panel and dial a code. Okay. Alright, what's the code? It's one, two, three, you're as stupid as can be! Aha! That right! If you think you can trap us in here, then- I wouldn't do that, Red. That's the airlock. And here's the trigger to send you into space! Right in my head! Foot. Thing. Airlock? Why would anyone make an airlock look like a control closet? To trick morons like you and sell you ransom. It was a cheap repair, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was. Now you better listen to me carefully. I've got myself jacked into a camera looking straight at you two. Anything happens to that, or the door, and I remotely jettison you into the vacuum of space. Now if you'll excuse me, I've got a call to make. These are dummy controls and he's totally right. We have absolutely no power here. I'm going to track down and destroy every droid in his series when I get out of here. Calling everyone on the planet below. Calling on all frequencies. My buddy. Come on, you fancy assholes. Pick my signal. Yes. Hello, fine sir. Are you a Coruscant citizen? What else would I be? Then you should know that your prince and princess are missing. Missing because I have them. In the airlock of my grand ship, the Ghost. Now to get them back, you're gonna have to give me 100 billion credits in the form of a bank transfer or cash. No, actually, make that cash. I will only accept my 100 billion credits to give them back in cash. I can't believe this! Nor can I! Marla, what's happening? We're gonna die. We're probably gonna be stuck hanging out with the Emperor for eternity. What the? The droid is going to throw us out the airlock any second. Then just use the force. On what? The doors, the droid, the ship, the trigger, the airlock, all of the above. We can't do that. You're going to have to try. Yes, I suppose so. Luke, focus on keeping the airlock together. I'll open the doors. Yes, Coruscant hasn't had a prince or a princess in a thousand years. So, unless these two are a couple of Yodas, they're not royalty. What?! <laughs> Mara, you're doing it! Hey! This guy says you're not royalty! Will you cripple with me, or is he cripple with me? Uh, he is. Ah, okay, okay. I get it. You just don't wanna pay me. Well, I'm gonna stay here until you do. They've got less than a day worth of oxygen in the airlock. They're gonna die. Just because you're too selfish to give me the 100 billion credits I deserve. Land the ship right now or I'll cut you into tiny chunks. What the? How did you? I told you, we're Jedi. But the other guys I knew could barely do anything! Oh, and by the way, I'm the Prince of Naboo, not Coruscant. Now, oh, fine. You win this time. But I was real close. The voice you heard before was our malfunctioning droid, requesting permission to land. Hello, Skywalker. Do you like your droids sliced or cubed? Hey! You can't do that to me! I rigged myself with explosives just in case anyone ever tried. That's a lie, isn't it? I could never convince anybody to do it for me. In that case, I'd like cubed, Mara. <gasps> um. What? Am I dead yet? Don't look now, the police are right behind you. So? Ugh, I told you not to look! We have to get out of here! Mara, there's nothing to worry about. The only crime we committed was stealing the ship back on Tatooine, and I doubt they- Think a bit further back, darling. Oh yeah, you tried to cut my head off in the kitchen. Maybe I can just roll away. Wait, the only people who know about that are- Your family, yes. 
One of them must have blabbed. They could be looking for somebody else. Yes, but I'm not about to take any chances. I have to be very careful from now on. We'll cut and dye our hair, refer to each other only by cover names, steal some clothes to disguise us further, and travel only through the lowest levels of the city until we make it to- Hey, hey, there he is! Oh, no. Look, Ben, we found- We win! High five! Who are they? You met them back at the apartment, Mara. They're my brother-in-law, my nephew. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not going- Chill. Chill. Han's cool. He's on the wrong side of the law around here himself. He won't give us any trouble. Look what's up. Your mom's like freaking out about you. Ah. A lot of crazy cark, man. Knew it. I try to tell Leia. Hey, I better call her. No, that... That will not be necessary. No, it is. She's out with your mom and she's got the key to the apartment. The same apartment she locked us all out of until we find you. But you're with us now! We don't need a key, we've got the Force! I've got a skeleton key that works better than the Force, Luke. I just want you there so she doesn't yell at me. And she doesn't actually know I have a skeleton key. Wait a second, what do you mean, we? Han, I'm with... Mara? Mara? Damn it, Mara, where are you? Luke, no, I don't! Oh, You know what? I'm using the skeleton key. Finally! What the hell are you doing? Disarming some stormtroopers. Is that code for killing these days? I only stunned them. Yeah, which means they're gonna wake up. What kind of assassin are you? I kept them alive for your sake, princess. And I only had to attack them because of how much time you were wasting chatting. Now come on, we've got- No, your plan is stupid. For once, you're gonna follow my instructions. Come with me, princess. Look, my parents won't be back yet. We'll just stop here and make a real plan. Fine. Hello? Hey, he's back. See, it's just Han. He might be able to- Your mom's been yelling at me ever since I got here. Good thing she didn't find my key that doesn't exist, right, Luke? Anyway, now that you're here, you can take the heat for me. Hey, Luke's here! Luke! Mara, act natural. There's a chance that Dad never said anything to her. He was the only one who saw- Oh, Luke, where have you been? What happened? Are you okay? Did- What the hell is she doing here? I've been on Tatooine. Uh, I, I was kidnapped, you know, by Jango Fett, but I'm guessing you already- Luke, what is she doing here? Listen, Mom, Dad got it all wrong. He said that this person was trying to kill you with a lightsaber! Dad just misinterpreted uh, what was happening, because he- Luke, we heard her threatening to shoot and strangle you. Ah. Uh, well, you see, we're over that now. Over it? We have a special connection that we just didn't recognize at the time, and you guys just wouldn't understand, you know? You know, since you're both in failing toxic marriages. Hey! My marriage may be failing and toxic, but it... Uh, uh. What's marriage got to do with anything? Oh, yeah, I didn't mention that part. Nice going, Skywalker. It has nothing to do with anything. Obviously, I'm just being me. Making irrelevant points. Irrelevantly. As usual. Mara, help me! Our little, um... You see, what's... What's been going on is, uh... How you show affection in my family. I, I um... You see, my family is so strange that, um... That's how you show how much... How much you like someone, so we decided to... Go to hell with it and get married. What? 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 I'm salvaging a train wreck here, dearest. Do you think they believe that I'd be attracted to that? Well, you know, it makes sense. A couple of crazies together. <laughs> like you're not. Eh, you got me there. Yeah, crazy is the word. What is wrong with you? Luke, what the hell? I'm sorry. Why? 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 
It's complicated. Is this like are we being filmed for one of those prank holla shows? You have no idea how much I wish we were. So you have nothing to say for yourselves? No explanation at all? Nip, you've heard the whole story, that's it, nothing more to it. Come on, Skywalker, let's go. Okay, bye everybody. Han, I'm here to kick your ass! If I have to go out on those sorry ass streets looking for Luke, you do too! Hello? Dad? Oh, hey Luke. You know, a text about this would've been nice. Oh, Criff, you're here too. Well, enjoy your last moments without bars obscuring the view. I'm calling the cops. No! Dad, you can't do this! Too late, I've got him on speed dial text alert. They'll be on their way. Oh, yeah, no way, you're not going anywhere. Step aside. Mar, don't try it! Cute. Luke! Ah. I... <laughs> Please. I'm sorry, Mom. Luke, what are you? <laughs> Mark, come on. Get back here. He's got my lightsaber! Yeah, and he cut a hole through the wall with one. Anakin, there's a new development to this story you really should know about. What? Where are we going? I don't know. I just gotta... <laughs> turn around, turn around! Oh, hey, there they are. Excuse us. Could you stop for a minute to... Ron! Ross, start the engine, you idiot. <laughs> Be cut off, eh? We're gonna need backup headed towards 42nd Street. We hear you loud and clear, eh? Sending speeder bike units down there right now. I think we lost them. Not quite. on this wall. <laughs> Whoa. Are they okay? Don't know, don't care. Look, if we're going to make it out of here alive, we're going to have to get to the underworld and leave the planet in a different sector. If that's what we have to do, then let's stop talking about it and do it. <laughs> Come on! Go. Look, an elevator. We can make it to the lower levels from there. We have broken a lot of laws today. We're going to be breaking a lot more, so get used to it. Come on, come on. Is it coming from the planet's core? Hurry up. Put your hands in the air. You are under arrest and you have no rights. Bugger off! But you little bitch. Fire around at him, Ross. But sir, you're the one at the gun controls. Well, I'll do it myself if you're that lazy, Ross. Going down. 
Or close the doors, close the doors! I always hated gingers. <laughs> oh my force. We did it! We did it! We did it! You were amazing! Me? You did the thing? Well, with the speeder bikes? And, and the band? I don't know if they're alive, but it was awesome. Oh my force. I didn't know you had it in you. You're something else, Skywalker. So, that thing you said about, uh, disguises, cutting our hair, is that still... Yes, it has to happen. We're much too recognizable. I guess so. Oh, man. It's a shame. Your hair looks so nice. Oh, oh you think so, do you? <coughs> anyway, we're going to have to find some scissors to cut it with. Well, if you like it so much, Mara, I can just cover my head with a hat. Only gang members wear hats on Coruscant. What? You've never been to the underworld, have you? No. You are now on level 1313. Then this could be rather shocking. Oh dear. Mom, this can't be right. I know Luke's a little... crazy, but I don't think he'd do this without some kind of reason. You still got my lightsaber. I know, I know, I just... can't think of what. I've had that lightsaber for like 20 years. Maybe she said she'd kill him if he didn't. Or something. Then why would he help her escape? He better be keeping it safe. It's gotta be something to do with the whole Jedi Force power thing. I've never been so mad at him before in my life, and I've been really mad at him before. Perhaps he owes her something. <laughs> no, not cheese. Why is it always cheese with you, R2? Why cheese? I'm so worried about him. Hey, he's got himself into more trouble than this before and come out of it in one piece. If he breaks my lightsaber, I am going to kill him. I gotta find it. We're just gonna have to wait and see what happens. I don't like it, but it's all we can do. Come on, man, let me into the club. My friends are in there. Dengar and Forlom. Oh, my ears are already cold. This feels so weird. I haven't had short hair in years. Keep quiet and put the clothes on. They smell like B.O. and barf. Too bad. Put them on. Oh, do I have to? Put them on. Okay, fine, fine. If you're so eager to watch me get undressed, who am I to deny you? <laughs> in your dreams? The sacrifices we have to make for marriage. I'm sure I look even worse than I smell right now. You look fine. Now stop being such a girl and hurry up. So where are we going? First of all, we need to get on a train as soon as possible. Wherever we're going, it's a honeymoon destination, alright? Wait, for real? Yes, I'm just dying to go on a romantic escape with you. It's our cover story if anyone asks, idiot. Yeah, well, you could have fooled me. It's not like you wasted any time marrying me. Oh, shut up. Let's go to the station. Or making me take my clothes off in front of you. That was nothing more than necessary, Skywalker. Just saying, you could have turned around. Mara! Update, please. What's going on? Um... Well, things could be better. I'll be super honest. How do you mean? We're on the run. Oh, from the law, right. I suppose that makes sense. Anyway, I've decided that you're going to ascend to the throne A-S-A-P. Now I understand you don't want to kill your mother, and I must admit, that would be bad publicity. So I've thought of a way around it. You're going to tell her to abdicate, and then you'll take the throne and start conquering the galaxy from there. Okay, yeah, I'll just tell her to step down so I can take over. She'll definitely go for that. She will when you threaten to kill her. Awesome. That's so much better. 
Don't backsass me, boy. Can we please focus on getting a ship? We can't do any of that from jail. Remember, Marla. A S A P. Great talking to you as always, Emperor. Let's go get that train. We're almost there. It's just um. <laughs> Quick, down the alleyway! Whoa! What? Quiet! There are stormtroopers at the station entrance. They've obviously upped security. So we're higher priority than we thought? We've beaten up and killed several policemen today, evaded arrest, and caused several speed crashes. They don't like that. So what the hell do we do? Run away or try to take all of them on. Take your pick. They're gonna start shooting at us as soon as they see us. I don't think we can bat away that many blaster bolts with just three lightsabers. We have to try running some more. Okay, let's go this way. Mara, wait! Whoa! So there you two are! Oh my force. Wait a second, I'm running away from you. Stop! Oh no! Oh, crib me! Crib me in my life! Where have you come from? Uh, 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 from, from down at the, uh, from down the. <laughs> Calm down! You sound like a screaming gonk droid. I'm sorry. I guess you two freak shows are scary. All right. Tell me where you've come from, or I will blast you into tiny pieces. Well, uh, after you got distracted by that guy who was looking for Blondie, I just rolled away. Then I went down to the port, and then I came here to look for somebody to trick into helping me steal a ship before I threw him out of the airlock like I was gonna do with you twos. That's the truth. Now please don't shoot me. Show us the way there. Are you sure? It, it's not like a real port, it's just a shady little place where mercs and bounty hunters land their ships. Even better. Here we are. See that one over there? That's the one I wanted to steal. Big and gray, Corellian. Looks real roomy. Wow. It looks exactly like Han's old ship. Oh my, force the memories. Look, that must be the owner. Yeah, nasty piece of work. He's killed a lot of people. Nice. I'm going to distract him and you're going to steal the ship with Chopper. Wait over there for my signal. Wait, what the? Damn it! I get the feeling we'll know it when we see it. Come on, you dumbasses! They went this way! I can feel it! Sir, I really don't think we need your help on this search. When? When did you get here? Mmm. Mind tricks are frying his brain. I'm in charge of the search party. You're in charge of this search party, eh? That's right! That's, That's right. right! Good. This way. I can feel they're close. I'm gonna find my damn lightsaber. Hello, sir. Do you feel like donating your ship today? Depends. What are you offering for it? Your life. Fine! It's a piece of cock anyway! No doubt about it. Now give me- <gasps> You're not very good at this, are you? What the bloody hell is going on? Chopper, we have to help her. No, 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 don't, 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 don't. It's the cops. We have to. You can't help her if you get arrested too. Ugh, oh, you're right. Why are you right? Now hand it over. What? My force damn lightsaber that you and Luke stole. I don't have it. Luke is the one who stole it, you idiot. Well, where's he? <laughs> I don't know. Ugh! Book her, you morons! And can somebody take this piece of crap off me? You are under arrest and you have no rights. If you wish to have rights, contact an upper class or rich family member when we get to the station. These are force proof, eh? Now move along. Now I just gotta find Luke. Do you know where he is? No. Some help you were! Oh, oh! 
Okay, Chopper, we are totally screwed. Mara's going to jail, and my dad's after me. Did you see what he did to that guy? Wait, what? You heard me. No, 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 but your father? That lunatic you just saw is my father. Oh, sweet criff. That's your dad? Man, he must be crazy disappointed in a sissy like you. He was a straight up badass. Yes, my father hates me. How did you know? Well, you did steal his property. It was a rhetorical question, Chopper. I have no idea what to do. Let's just take the ship and leave. Your papa knocked the owner out. No, I'm not going anywhere without Mara. She's my number one priority in the whole galaxy. Do you understand? Okay, fine, love boy. But at least tie that guy up so we can take the ship later. Chopper, where even are we? I told you, this is where I found the guy who told me about that port. And look at how well that turned out. Hey, if Mara just hurried up and killed that guy, your dad never would have caught her, and we would be long gone by now. Look, there's my guy now. Wait. Oh, great. Tiny orange droid is back. A uh, little bit left. Oh, I see you brought a scruffy little friend this time as well. Obadiah? Oh, it's pronounced Obi-Wan, you idiot. What? When did you get your memories back? Wait, look, you know him? Oh my force, it's you. Well, um, uh, I got my memories back some. I think some two weeks after I lost them. You've been faking it the whole time? Save for the first two weeks, yes. Why? For the free food and pretty nurses. One day, Luke, you'll learn to appreciate the feminine form. Okay, about that. You're gay, I knew it. I held out hope for years, but deep down I always knew. Especially when you grew out your hair and started having it feathered. No! I'm married! Well, you know, we are on Coruscant. That doesn't exactly... To a woman. A pretty, curvaceous woman who doesn't look like a man. Yes, a freaking beautiful woman who looks nothing like any man. And she's in jail, so I gotta get her out of jail before the Emperor haunts me. Evil ghost troubles, eh? How do you know? I am so criffin' confused right now, you don't even know. The Force is my powerful and mystical ally in many ways, Luke. How did you really know? The Emperor popped in on me a couple of minutes ago. He wanted to know where Brendel Hux was, his old lawyer, I think. I didn't know. Anyway, you say the Emperor's going to haunt you. Yes, he says he can give me hallucinogenic nightmares day and night. Is nobody gonna explain all this cock to me? You really are stupid, aren't you? He can't do anything. What? The most he can do is annoy you a bit, and he can hardly do that. Sith ghosts have tiny real-world interaction data plans. But... I... He, I got married tomorrow because he said if I didn't, he'd haunt me. I traveled across the galaxy. I... I... He's been plaguing you for a fool. So if you're only saving this wife of yours for his sake, don't bother. Come on, I'll show you this great place. Dex Jr.'s Diner. You can buy me a hot dinner and a nice beer and we can catch up. No, I... I've still gotta help Mara. Well, if you think she's still worth saving, then I suppose she must be something really special. Yeah, she is. Hmm. Well, I suppose you must be straight then. Yeah, always have been. Alright, in that case, I'll help you. But you'd better buy me a beer for it. Sure, all the beers you want. Can they be the good 10 credit kind? Only if this works. Okay, let's go. Seriously. Is no one gonna explain this to me?
I must say I'm quite intrigued as well. You can tell us the full story on the way to the police station. Okay, just bear in mind that all this was before I knew the Emperor was bluffing. And is apparently powerless. This should be good. We're gonna go in with the wham bam. First we're gonna wham him in the face. Then we're gonna bam him in the stomach. I still can't believe you got captured by a mini astromech droid. He's very clever. And then we're gonna kick him where it hurts. And then Luke's gonna lightsaber the walls apart. He doesn't sound it. Think of it this way, Luke. If it weren't for the Emperor helping you, he would have killed you. Yeah, well, if the Emperor didn't butt in and ruin my life in the first place, I never would have met him. So what do you think of my plan? Pretty epic, right? I feel that we could think of something a little bit more intelligent than that. After all, a 10 credit beer is on the line. I haven't had one of those in two decades. Closer to three. Oh, my force, do I need one. Well, first we gotta save Mar from imprisonment. Really, Luke, why are we doing this? I told you, you don't need her. The Emperor can't do anything more than he already has. Yeah, Luke, seriously. We can just go now. It will be pretty awesome, but we don't have to destroy a police station. No, we're gonna go into that building, and we're gonna get Mara out whether you two like it or not. So, what was your plan with the wham and the bam? Get in there! It's also force-proof, so forget about trying to escape. So, what you in for? A lot. You? I'm only here because I stole some Rodian's wallet and his milkshake. What? Hey, don't you judge me! I've hit on some hard times. I just got out of seven years in the Nubian Royal Dungeon, and they didn't even let me go. They totally forgot about me. I only got out because crocodiles started raining from the sky. And I managed to squeeze out a tiny hole made in the wall by one of them. That sounds a whole lot crazier out loud. It's called the Croc-nado. And when I got out, I nearly cocked my pants. Because I saw some chick. Some chick get hit in the face by a 200 mile an hour flying crocodile. Right about that, listen. Wait a second. That was you. I can't believe you're alive. Small galaxy. Yes, very. Now, tell me, are you Force-sensitive? What does that mean? Right, I'll take that as a no. Do you want to bust out of here? <laughs> yeah, sure, but there's no way to do it. You see, I think there might be. I have the Force. What's that again? Isn't that like the, the Jedi thing? Yes, more or less. Which is why they've put me in a special cell to stop me from using it to escape. But, since you don't, I'm sure your cell is entirely average. And? I can use the Force to get you out of there if you get the key to unlock my cell. What's the catch? I can strangle you with the Force if you don't get me out. There it is. There's always something. I'll keep a lookout and you two can rush the place to get her out. Funny how you get the easiest and most useless job. Why do we need a lookout? This is the only police station for miles. Besides, you have no way to warn us. I just think it makes sense. Now go do the tiny droids boom, bang, whap, whatever thing. And come back here so you can buy me that full stamp beer. Fine, old man. Let's go, ass chin. Oh. Excuse me, sir. How can I help you? Yeah, I'm looking for the homeless shelter. Can you tell me where it is? Oh, that makes sense. It's a couple of blocks down after the first right. Well, actually, you take a left after the right, and then it's a couple of blocks down. Thanks. Oh! Oh! Ow! Damn! Come on. Hello, welcome to the 607-14 police station. How can I help you? Hi, where are the cells? Oh, right. Just head down the hall, take a right, and head straight past the bathrooms. 
thanks. That was, uh... Kinda easy, don't you think? Yeah, I mean... In my mind, she was gonna say no, and then I would whip out my lightsaber, and she would just tell me, but it was gonna be really badass, and... Oh, damn, I'm an idiot. Yeah, he's just down there, boys. Go get him. All right, men. On my signal, we are running there. Look, get your glow stick out. But I don't know how many cops there are. I can't risk getting hit by even one stun shot, then it's all over. I'll go through the ventilation. You distract them. What? Don't worry about me, Chopper. Why, you little butt of bitch. Now! Eh? What are you doing here, eh? Have... Have you ever heard the tragedy of... HK-47... The Cool? No. Can we hear it? Now, I gotta say... They should think about making stuff that stops people from using the Force, instead of stuff you just can't use the Force on. Like Force inhibiting stuff, you know what I'm saying? Would you just shut up for two seconds? I've got my lightsaber back from the god, so let's get out of here. Come on! Absolutely! Well, I don't say this very much, but- Lando! Lando Calrissian. And what is your name? Doesn't matter. It matters to me. If you won't tell me, I'm just gonna have to guess until I get it right. Now let's just think, <sighs> is it... Mara? Oh. Oh great. There's no one here. Oh, and there's a lightsaber hole in the wall. Damn. How did she manage that? It stop right there. Okay, man. Okay. I'm just gonna... Escape! That was awesome. Man, I gotta tell Mara about that. Alright, time to get out of here. Not so fast. Oh, great. Okay, it's been ages now, he's ditched me, he used some other exit, and he's completely disappeared, just so he doesn't have to buy me the beer I deserve. What a git. Well, Criff, you too, Luke. You look like a hobo, a smelly little hobo. Hmm. Smell it, hobo git. Anastasia. Eliza. Karen. Go Mallory, away. Bella. Mara! Josephine. There you are. Laura, Chopper, where's Luke? He's, uh... You know, actually, he got caught trying to rescue you. What? Angela. But, uh... No, it looks you know, like you escaped on your own fine. just fine. Crazy oh! Though, you know, on Wait! State, you what? He the said there was something really important he had to tell you once we busted then, you out. It was, uh... Something about some guy called the I Emperor. Mean, he said you had to know. You what is it? I don't know. I can't remember. I was just thinking about all the whamming and the bamming. Hey, uh, don't I know you from somewhere? No, I'm a droid. There's a cock ton of others who look just like me. You've never seen me before in your life. We've got to find him, come on. Wait, who is this Luke guy? Her husband. What? Wait, so that's why she was telling me to beat it? No, not at all. I just don't like you. I'm gonna go beg for spare change. At least it's legal and I ain't gonna get fooled by some hard-ass chick. 
Oh, 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 where am I? Oh, oh, my leg. Oh, oh, why? Oh, force. And I call myself a Jedi. I got shot by a cop. Why would you shoot me and then stun me? Police brutality, man. Oh, my leg. Oh, no. No, no. It's found me. Luke! Mara? Thank goodness you're okay. Come on, we've got to- Mara, I'm- uh, I'm not okay. What's the matter? They shot me. What? You heard it right the first time. Uh, it's my leg. It's not very deep. You should be okay. Now we have to move. You can- Mara, uh, before we go, I have to tell you something. We haven't got- No, you have to hear it. The- Ah, uh, the Emperor, he's been tricking us. He can't do anything. What? He lied. It was a load of crap. You're sure? Yes. An old Jedi Master told me. I can't believe it. We did all this for nothing. Are you gonna leave me now? Mara? No. Come on. That dead. I know it. I can feel it. And I was starting to like him. Hey, robot. Have you seen a blonde kid around here? Ah, uh, define kid. A child man with long blonde hair. Wears mainly black. Yeah, I, uh, I kind of know him. Wah! Where is he? He's at the police station, but, but I'm pretty sure he's just a corpse at this point. Ah, Luke! Come on, they had to put my lightsaber somewhere. We'll just have to go without it. No, ah, uh, I don't know how to make another one. I know how to, I can show you. Yeah, sure. Like you're gonna be sticking around uh, long enough for that to happen. What do you mean? You know the Emperor can't do anything now. I'm not going to leave you. There is literally no reason for you to stick around. I'm... Ugh, I'm surprised you're helping me now. Luke, listen to me. We're in this together. I'm staying whether you want me to or not. Mara, I... Thank you. And you better not be getting any ideas about ditching me. I'll just track you down again. Well, ugh, I wouldn't want to waste any more of Django's time. Good, now come on, there's no... Luke! Ah! Give me my lightsaber back. Now. I don't even have it! Oh yeah? Where is it? Somewhere in the station. Ah, I can't find mine either. Oh. Can't you sense your crappy lightsaber? If you can sense yours, why did you even ask where it was? It's about testing character, Luke. I wouldn't expect you to understand. Yeah, well, if you ask me, it's about- We really need to get out of here! Oh yeah? To go where? We've got to get off planet. Chill, woman. Don't be so damned afraid of the cops. Just to let you know, they can't do anything when I'm around. Plus, only half the cops in the Trisector area are still breathing thanks to you two. I... Uh, I guess... What the hell happened to you? Oh, you just noticed. He got shot. Oh. And you're both just gonna stand around doing nothing about it? You guys should go on the road. Best comedy double act I've seen in a while. And what do you expect me to do about it? Magically heal it with the Force? Like a mentally defective youngling? Yeah. What? Force heal, Luke. Literally every self-respecting Force user knows how to do it. At very least themselves. Oh, come here. Done. Ow, that really feels awesome. Wow. All right, very impressive. Now, not really. Now let's go, Luke. To the apartment. Now. 
So... After the clothes and the hair change, Dad found Mara and gave her away to the cops. I tried to rescue her, uh, but she already escaped. Somehow. And I got captured and shot, only for Mara to come and rescue me instead. So, here we are. That's it. And there were no death sticks involved. Not even one. Not even one. This is insane. Luke, how could you be so stupid and gullible, what am I saying? For once, the chances of something like this happening are a complete unknown. Nothing so bizarre has ever happened in the history of the galaxy. Erkin, can you believe this? Look, I'm not gonna say that Luke made the smartest choices. But I will say that Palpatine is probably the most convincing liar in the galaxy. He got the whole Senate to agree to giving him emergency powers, and convinced everyone he wasn't a Sith Lord despite the retroactive obviousness of it. That takes some lying skills. Yes, yes exactly. Just what I was going to say. Okay, fine. He's a convincing liar. Now what? We're going to leave planet. Oh yeah? To do what? To go where? We... didn't really think that far. I mean, we have to go, but- Of course you didn't! Of course you didn't. You never think, Luke. You just do! But the Jedi always said to feel and not think. Oh, and look how far that philosophy's got you! You're a wanted criminal on the run with a wife you've only known for like two days! It's not Luke's fault. You know what? You're right. You're completely right. It's not Luke's fault at all. It's all yours! Oh, 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 yeah. If it wasn't for you trying to kill him, none of this would have happened! Get out. Mom. Get out. Right now. Mom, you can't just- No, I can. I want you to get out of my apartment, and I don't want you to see me or any of my family ever again. You can exit through the hole in the wall you made. Actually, she can't. Old Lady Kanata just finished putting up new drywall. Just leave and never come back! Fine. No, you can't just go! Looks like I have to. But you... Goodbye, Luke. Uh, I... I... Luke, dare I even ask? 27 seems a little old to have my mother tell me who I can and can't see, don't you think? Mom! What part of tried to kill you don't you understand? Oh, do not pretend you care! All you really care about is your force damn lightsaber, not me! Mara cared. Mara chose to help me, even when she didn't have to. She would have been better off not helping me, but she did it anyway. When have any of you ever done that for me? That's right. Never. Luke, be rational here. The No. I'm gonna continue doing, and not thinking, and I'm gonna do this! Goodbye! Do you think he's gone for good this time? It's just me. Another checkup. Are you off course and yet? Ugh. Doesn't look like it. Almost. Excellent. And then you can start your conquest of the galaxy in my name. Just as soon as you have your mother-in-law give you Naboo. It's all coming together. Actually, I don't think it is. We've changed our plans a bit, you see. Or rather a lot. Have you already forgotten about my promise? My promise to haunt you for the rest of your life. Please be right, Luke. Do it! Go on. Do your worst. Hit me with your best shot. What? What, 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 what? Go on. I haven't all day. <laughs> Can't do anything. I know. Ah! Oh, curse you! Mara, I'm going back to plan A. Kill him. Kill Luke Skywalker. I can't. Do it. No. Uh, I, I'm sorry, what was that? I don't think I heard you correctly. It sounded like you said no. I did, because I'm not going to kill Luke. Not for anything. 
Why not? Because he doesn't deserve to die. He's brave and loyal and kind and strong and is exactly the kind of person this galaxy needs. Marla, I am every single one of those things and more. What is one thing he has that I date? My love. I love him. Oh, how disgusting! You don't even know the meaning of that word. That hideous, weak word. I'll leave you to your pitiful life. But I'll be back, and sooner than you expect. Mark my word. So, what was that about not liking me before? Luke? I mean, I like you too, but don't you think we're moving a little fast? Well, I, I, I mean to say, I, I, you, you, you weren't really supposed to hear what I, um, I... Cause I don't. Luke, you, you, you don't have to stay with me if, I, I, what I'm trying to say is, I, you don't have to stay with me if you don't want to. I, I'll understand if you... If I what? Want to leave. I don't want to force you into anything else. Hey, who's being the stupid one now? If I didn't want to stay with you, why would I have followed you here? Well, I... Mara, I love you too. Oh. Well, that's okay then. Mm. 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 Hey, what? 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 Woke? Mara? Mm. I thought you were dead! And now I find you here, sucking each other's faces off. And... Not looking for me. Nice. We were... gonna get around to that. Probably not. So, we still getting off planet on the freighter we save for later? The big grey Corellian one? Yeah, let's just take that one. Let's go get that piece of cock fired up! Well, presumably, if you locked it like you said you did, then it should be right work. Come on, come on! If I could just hook that landing ramp and pull it down... Lando? What? Luke? Mara? You're that Luke? Prince Luke Skywalker who left me to rot in jail for seven years? That Luke? How do you know him? We go back a long way. How do you know him? He helped me escape the police cell. This galaxy is way too small. Yeah, you're telling me. So... Obviously, you're not happy about being imprisoned, huh? Yeah, you left me to- Hey, I didn't have anything to do with it! I didn't even know you were down there! When no trial came up, I just assumed my mom let you go. Wait, it was all your mom? Yeah, I mean, that's not cool. No, it is not! Hey, if you want to take it up with her, then she's at number 62 in the Nubian Temporary Housing Complex. I do! She needs to know how seven years of starvation and darkness psychologically affected me! Go, man. Tell her exactly what you think about that shoddy ruling. What kind of a queen, right? Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I will tell her. I'm gonna tell her exactly what I think. Thanks, man! <laughs> wow. That was her real address. Yeah. She deserves it, though. Just like Lando deserved all that jail time. What was he locked up for, anyway? Long, long story. It includes nuclear war and the conquest of Corellia. I'll tell you on the ship. Okay, I got her all hot wide while you were talking to the spice head. But I have got to hear the story about how you know him, too. And I'm gonna tell the story. So it all starts with C-3PO being in love with my mother. 